Hi babes, welcome to my channel. It's your girl Shell Nicole. Today we are going to be swatching and reviewing the Ellie Ree and ColourPop collaboration. If you're not familiar with Ellie Ree, she is a Instagram and YouTube star. She has like over a million followers on uh, Instagram. I'm not sure about YouTube, but I, I'm pretty sure it's in the millions. Um, she's known for her different makeup looks. She is a chocolate brown girl um so i was excited to see that ColourPop actually did a collaboration with a brown girl because if you know anything about the brand they do do collaborations with different ethnicities but it has never been one of us so i was excited to see that the shades that um ellie Ree actually came out with were brown girl friendly so let's let me go off in a tangent for a second so y'all know that since Fenty came out with the 45 shades, everybody's trying to jump on board. Everybody's trying to jump on board with the let's make makeup that is every skin tone friendly. Um, let's rewind. Let's let's back up. Because not too long ago, I know for me personally, if I wanted to get a really expensive brand of makeup, my shade had to be mixed in. Because I have a little bit of red, I have a little, I have a lot of brown, and my skin changes from the summer to the winter. So let's just applaud Fenty for a second. Let's let's applaud because she really came in and changed the game. And the six eight shades that she came out with are friendly for my skin tone. It was like a bright pink color, as you you'll be able to see in the swatch video. A bright pink color there's a red color there's like a nude a couple nudes a dark burgundy color and then like a chocolate color all really pretty colors that not even my skin tone but all the skin tones can wear which is the type of makeup that I like to buy um, it is a matte liquid lipstick so when I did the swatch videos I did have difficulty even taking it off which is a good thing that means like when you eat you'll still have it on your lips or, you know, you you at work or taking the kids, uh, running errands and things of that nature, you'll still be able to actually see the lip gloss or she did come out with the lip gloss, but the liquid lips that you, you'll actually be able to still see the shade, which is a good thing. Um, and just a little disclaimer on my uh, swatch videos or the swatch pictures that you're about to see. Um, this is my first swatch video so um yeah some I, I had a little difficulty because doing the different pictures i had to take off the the actual um lipstick so it was kind of hard to get off especially for a matte and i'm scrubbing i had to reapply the um makeup around my lips it was just a whole mess so it is my first one so it is what it is i'm proud of my work um let me know what you think Thank you so much. That's it for my review, basically. I love it. Um, oh, let me tell you one thing. The whole collection is $28. I believe if you want to buy the individual one, they're like $7, $7, if I'm not mistaken, or like maybe $8.50. No, I think they're I think they're six dollars if I'm not mistaken. So it is cheaper to get the collection, which is what I bought. Um, and again, my review is very good about this. Um, again, it's brown girl friendly. The shades are gorgeous. She just rocked this whole collaboration and the names are just very unique. Not something that you hear on a regular basis. So that's what I love. So thank you. For